So, uh, I say let's just jump right into it. Let's do this. Let's see if I can, uh, pull this off. So we're playing The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past on the Nintendo Switch. We have to uh, start a new game here. Part of the rules if you're going to submit a run. I don't even know if I can uh, put all this on there. Go. Ah. Oh, I meant to put go, not two. We'll make it all one word. Go fast. Alright, so uh, here's my attempt. Number one, the no major glitches. Um, Master Sword Run. Try to start these at the try to start the timer and press this at the same time. So here we go. This is attempt number one. We are not gonna read all this because that would slow us down. And tonight we want to go fast. So that's what we're gonna do. All right. Basically, he told me stay here and don't follow him, which is exactly what we're gonna do. We're gonna stay here, and we are not going to follow him. We would never do that. We would always obey Uncle's instructions. Oh no, Uncle, what happened? Well, now I got a sword and shield, so it's on. Now, to be completely honest, I do not know the route for this. Uh, I kind of know the routing through the f first temple, but that's about it, so... As we get on later into the later rounds and stuff, I don't even remember the, uh, I don't remember the temples. I know how to get to them, but I don't know the pathing, so hopefully we don't get stuck in a level somewhere so right now what I'm trying to do is go get uh, Princess Zelda and that's what we're gonna do we're going to get the princess luckily the first dungeon here gives us the uh, Alright, Bucking Bronx, thank you for stopping in. Um. Ooh. So, uh. Zelda's been kidnapped. And. We're going to save her. I don't know if I need to pick that up or not. I've only watched a video of some guys doing this uh, probably once or twice and I haven't actually written down like where to go and stuff. This is my very first run, so <coughs> it's uh I hope I don't get stuck in a dungeon basically. 
or get some kind of weird death loop. Oh no, no, no. Okay, there we go. That was close. Kelsey, how's it going? What happened? Did I press the wrong button? Uh, hello? Go fast! Oh. Um. I'm supposed to be able to. Oh, I'm. This is not where I reset. See, this is what happens when you play the game for the first time. I'm supposed to reset at the sanctuary. <sighs> you know, you never want to PB too fast on your first run because then you don't have any room for improvement. You know. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm supposed to save and quit at the sanctuary. <laughs> Not uh saving quit in the dungeon. I'm going to put that in my notes. And uh Kelsey, I don't know that I'm that great at A Link to the Past. I've practiced only uh one of the uh nope I need to go this way I've only practiced one of the bosses for today and I'm not a hundred percent on the pathing for this uh, I've watched a couple of guys do it but I don't have any notes or anything with me so I hope we don't get stuck in a dungeon I think I know them well enough to where we should be okay but uh, when I get serious about making a run, I have to make some notes. I uh, get off there. And I'm going to go ahead and spend 30 minutes in the menu. And that way, uh, a new PB is free. See, I couldn't remember if there's a key here or not. Oh, it's the chest. Let's get off there. I need my my co-pilot here with me to help direct me. I don't even know if you can have somebody do that. Can you have somebody do that in a speed run? I guess we'll find out. Stop it. Also, um, just so everyone knows, if I haven't made it completely obvious, PB is free right now because I do not have one, so. Okay, this is where we save and quit, guys. Right here. And as soon as I get through all this text, I'll explain why. See, now it menu 
fast like it's supposed to. So we want to start from Go Fast House because that brings us on the part of the map that we want to be to get to the first dungeon. And so we're able to save and save and quit. Uh some of the other uh more complicated speed runs, you're not able to save and quit. And in fact, there's certain parts that if you die, uh, you have to go back to that screen. I believe it's at least that screen. So you can't simulate a save and quit. But luckily, we're not playing that, so... I might need that. And I'm also not doing any splits today. I don't have a foot pad or anything and uh, I was gonna have uh, Colin do it when he's here. Ah. But uh, we won't be doing splits today. Just going fast. Now there's a way to clear this room where the... These guys won't actually spawn. I haven't learned the steps for it, but that'll be something else that I'll be learning. There's a few... Uh, optimization things that are fairly easy I think I'll be able to do <coughs> excuse me and uh, I'll have to work on those off stream I doubt anybody's gonna want to watch me do that but you never know Con and I may get into it so The main point of today is to try to get a PB, kind of learn the pathing, and uh, hopefully don't die. I remember uh, when I was a kid, I thought uh, I thought these maps were ex absolutely huge. And now that I play them, they just seem smaller. What is going on? Uh oh. See, like, this room is taking way too long right now. I did this a little bit without sound earlier. I have no arrows. Uh oh. Well, I already messed up, so I'm supposed to have arrows. I think we're okay, we can get arrows up here.
All right, this is the room I was talking about where we got a line link's feet up. And we did it. Nice. Ah, uh, it's wrong button. I'm getting nervous. Alright, I haven't figured out this room either. No, it's a little slower, but I need four arrows for this. All right, here we go. I tried to readjust. Got him. All right. That was a pretty bad fight, but uh. Oh, I'm sorry, Cheryl. I didn't see your uh. Where are the skeletons? I'm so far past any of that. I'm not exactly sure what you're talking about. So right now what we're going to do is go back this way and now we can really go fast. So we'll get some uh we'll get the boots. I'm not mistaken. Uh, yeah, I save and quit. Start from my house, and let's go. Oh, thank you very much. So now we have to go to the library. Oh, that's up here, isn't it? See, I already went the wrong way. The library's up here. Uh, we're playing on the Switch here also. These just came out the other day. If you have Nintendo Online and a Switch, you can get uh, these nice, awesome graphics for yourself. So the library is up here, and now that we have the boots, we can get literacy. Because reading is important. <clears throat> and now, do we save and quit? 
I think I save and quit again. Ah, okay. Oh, now it's taking forever, so we definitely don't save and quit there. Come on, Switch. You can do it. Well, I really appreciate it. Yeah, it, uh... It took some time to set up, but now that we got it set up, I'm actually pretty happy with the setup that we have, so... I think I'll be keeping this set up for a little while. Yeah, it's a little bit cleaner than, uh... I went a little crazy with the first graphics. It's a little more mellow. Alright, so now that we have literacy, we're able to read. Oops. If I don't die, we can come up here. Oh, thank you, Kelsey, for uh, hosting. I don't know why that didn't come in. Uh oh. There we go. All right. I love that uh, that emote, Kelsey. Where did you get that from? Is that your emote? It was a good book read. All right. Now, hopefully, I can remember this path enough. Simple dude, huh? Oh no, don't die. Dying is bad. We we are not allowed. We're like marines. We are not allowed to die. <coughs> Without permission. And Link, you do not have permission. There's a heart. Oh, I went the wrong way. Yeah, I've been, uh, do we have a key? We don't, okay, so I need a key. Oh, it's on the lamp. So, I've, uh, since we just recently got our thing, I've been trying to come up with uh, a cool emote. We have one. But I'm not exactly satisfied with it. Oh, okay. Awesome, yeah. I do a lot of lurking myself, especially if I'm, like, cleaning the house or something. Okay, we don't need the compass. We don't know where... Oh, and I died. Now see, there you go. But it it would be uh, it would be very unique, and I think uh, I I can't talk and do this at the same time. I think people when they look for an emote, they want something that's unique, and so even though you may think it's kind of boring, it's unique, and. Uh, Personally, I like uh, emotes that are unique. Like my emote, for instance, if you've played uh, or seen someone play 
Breath of the Wild is the lady that uh, tells you to get off her flowers and we have a 51 above her head because of all the area 51 stuff exactly that's what I'm talking about good emotes Okay, don't die again, Link. You are not allowed to die. And he's really, really good. He is also one of my favorite uh, I can't sleep at night people to watch Mario. He's really super good. Exactly! Look at that! What did I just get? I don't even remember. Okay, I got the glove. I couldn't remember. So, anywho, explaining my emote, it was, um, it's the lady in Breath of the Wild that tells you to get off of her flowers. And we put a 51 on there. Can you still do this? You can. We put a 51 on there for all the Area 51 stuff. And it's uh, basically any time that I would mess up or, you know, I become salty or whatever. You can just spam that in chat. See, there it is right there. Number one subscriber. And, uh... She's got kind of an angry face. I'm still working on something that's kind of channel specific that's kind of cool. Uh, Colin and I were working on some. Uh, oh, I already have a key. I am slow today. get the key where's the key there's the key <coughs> I was about to say I thought they came out there they go Colin's been working on one and um, I'm gonna implement that one into one of the tiers I may move uh, the one that Cheryl has to maybe a higher tier or something I haven't decided yet. We're always looking for uh, new content to bring y'all. So the I know we've been working on Zelda 2. The reason I'm doing this in particular is Colin and I are going to pick uh, three speedrunning challenges and our goal for the challenges is to not be last. So we're going to pick three speedruns and our goal is not to be last in the leaderboards. So right now the last person uh, for this particular one is one hour and nine minutes so our goal is to beat that
Now I know there's a way to do this with the arrows. I am not good at it. Oh, please don't die, Link. Oh, you're killing me. Oh, bye, Cheryl. At least it's not that far. So I think if I can do this whole run, even without getting the... Yeah, and I have the practice cart. I just haven't practiced yet. And so if you ever do want to speedrun this, uh, there is a practice ROM out there and it is super awesome. I'm not exactly sure who it's made by. Oh, well, that's horrible. I mean, we're going to try this with two. Oh, I walked right into it. So, this is definitely one of the things I'm going to have to practice. I'm going to have to practice the bosses. I'm pretty sure if I can make a run, even where if I don't get the one cycle strats and stuff with the, uh, with the bosses... I'm thinking I can beat uh, 109. Um, the the only reason I say that. Oh, thank you. Well, this is going fantastic. Is uh, I don't know if. I can get Colin to a level where he'll be able to one cycle the bosses. Oh, I don't even have to light that anymore. All right. I remember even as a kid this being one of the hardest bosses. Got him. Okay, now he spits out six. Got him. All right, that's two down. Two to go. We got to get all the way up to Death Mountain. <coughs> Excuse me. Thank you. 
Once we get to Death Mountain... Uh, we beat the tower. Once we beat the tower, we get the Master Sword. And run number one is over. I will have a PB in a video game. First ever speed run for Travelite. I've actually done this run before and I recorded it, but I didn't stream it. Um We're probably supposed to save and quit there and go to the sanctuary. Yes, we were supposed to save and quit there and go to the sanctuary. All right. Pathing, guys. It's all about the pathing. Uh, I think once Colin plays this game enough, his combat skills are definitely good enough. We'll have to get him... Uh, Practicing some of the one cycle strats and stuff. Oh. This guy lost his lamp. How do you lose a lamp in a dungeon? Yes, this is one of my favorite games. Absolutely. <laughs> All right, we got the mirror. Yay. I've played a rando of this one time, Kelsey, and I apparently got a ridiculous seed and <clears throat> I didn't have one of the maps to follow I can't remember exactly what it was but uh, I got stuck and I think it was one of the caves I had to look in or something like that and it was pretty bad it took me, I want to say, like three hours to beat or something like that. And I didn't even fully beat it. Um, I don't think I actually got to Ganon. I don't remember. Oh my gosh. Might as well just die once I get in here so I can get uh, three heart pieces. That wasn't on purpose. I mean, that was on purpose, so I could get uh, three heart pieces. Oh, I don't need to go this. Oh, I gotta go here first. I probably did need to kill those guys. I'm one of those guys when I play a Zelda game, I just want to kill everything in the room. You know what I'm saying? <coughs> so I remember as a kid, 
the boss I'm not sure the name of the boss in in this room but the uh, or in this uh, castle but I remember him being extremely hard the ricochet that he does every time you hit him as a kid just threw me off so bad And it's kind of funny watching, uh, I've watched Colin uh, fight this boss quite a few times. He's actually surprisingly really good at it. I'm looking for uh, some hearts here. Supposed to be going fast. We got the big key. Oh, we can, uh, mirror back to here. Looky there. I'm glad that was on video because. Give me that heart. Ouch. I think I'm on the opposite blocks that I want. Pretty sure I want it to be on the other blocks. Oh, okay, it's just for right there. <coughs> Excuse me. Ah! Don't die, Link. What is this? Compass? We don't care. I guess I don't need the moon pearl, do I? Oh yeah, I probably do. I fall down here? No. Maybe one up? And this is the part where I'm stuck. Because I know you have to fall to get the moon pearl. I just don't remember where you have to fall at. Is it here? No. Okay. Ouch. Oh, I have to switch the things. Duh. Hmm. 
Moon Pearl. All right, knowledge acquired. Now, is there a guy down here? So I can get some life. Oh, get away from me. I guess we're going with three. Because we got to go fast. Now this guy is a kid was horrible. He's probably going to be horrible today. Like he's trolling me right now. He's like, I know you're going fast today. So... Ugh, he knocked me off. So every time you get knocked off, you have to start over. Knocked you back so far. He needs two more hits. Got him. Alright, on to the Master Sword. Here we go. Gotta go fast. We're at 46, we gotta beat 109. Don't remember if you have to save and quit. I'm assuming I can. Now I gotta remember how to get to the Master Sword. I haven't done this in a hot minute either. There it is. Oh. Time.
we did it that's the master sword run in a nutshell uh, if I hadn't have died 42 times and we'd have got a much better time uh, my time was actually about uh, 48 minutes 38 ish section second somewhere in there uh, I clicked off live split so it uh, 